Hello, and welcome to my college football picks for this weekend. Today is some good games, for sure. Not the best week so far, but definitely up there. Very, like, underrated games, I feel. And this could be pretty good, so, uh, yeah, let's get this started with our first game... Ohio State versus Maryland. This is a sneaky good game. Maryland is 5 and 0 while Ohio State is also 5 and 0 and Ohio State hasn't been playing great. I'm really like I really like the Maryland's offense right here. And I don't like Ohio State's offense honestly. So, I'm going to pick the upset, man. I got Maryland over Ohio State. Come McCord, I don't believe in him. I do believe in Tulia attack of I probably didn't say that right. But yeah, let's go Terps. Next game. Washington State UCLA. Very good game. Very good Pac-12 game. UCLA, even though they're not ranked, they're three and one. I still gotta go with Washington State though. Still Washington State. Gonna be a close game. I, I think 31-20. Just Washington State really looks good, honestly, right now. I think they pull off the win. Should be a good game, though. I'm excited for that one. Next up, we got Kentucky-Georgia. Classic SEC match. Kentucky just got ranked, but I still think Georgia wins. It's going to be another close one. It's going to be like that South Carolina game. I think Georgia wins by 10. But Kentucky's offense has looked pretty good. But yeah, Georgia wins here. I do think Kentucky, they're definitely going to get a bowl game. I don't know if Georgia three-peats. I don't think so. I don't think they three-peat, but it's going to be close. Next, we got LSU, Missouri. A lot of people, even though LSU is three and two, people still think LSU is going to win. I don't know why LSU is still ranked. This is so easily Missouri. They played great. LSU's played horrible. Easily Missouri wins here. For sure. I think Missouri could actually be an SEC contender if they beat Georgia. And they beat Georgia. But they, that's not going to happen. Next, we got Alabama, Texas A&M. I got Texas A&M. Alabama's looked really bad for Alabama. 17-3 against who? USF. Lost to Texas. But, yeah. Texas A&M. I think only loss is to Miami. I think they've only lost one game. I'm going to go Texas A&M here. I think they pull it off the upset. Especially if they're playing at Texas A&M. I'm not sure. I think they are. But yeah, Texas A&M wins. We got the big game of the week. Red River Rivalry. This is a really good game. This is what I call a great game. Both of these teams are so good. Both of these teams, it's not going to be a blowout like last year. But, you know, I really like Quinn Ewers. I love Quinn Ewers. He's my second favorite player in the league. I got to go with Texas. It's going to be close. It's going to be close. I just don't think Dylan Gabriel can do it. I don't think he can do it. I got Texas. 45-38. Texas. Hook up. Let's go. But yeah, Texas wins easily. Not easily, not easily, not easily. Because Oklahoma's defense has been really good. I don't know if Quinn Ewers is going to be able to do what he does. But I think he will. I think he will. And I think Dylan Gabriel is going to throw at least two interceptions. And Texas gets the win. Thanks for uh, thanks for watching. I'm going to plan to do this every week now. From now on. And yeah, thanks for watching. Leave a like.